Daniel Degen, I'm from Carrick and Shannon, County Leitrim. Um, I'm doing the level A honours degree in civil engineering. Um, in my fourth year, I came straight from my leaving cert, did my leaving cert in June 2010 in Carrick and Shannon, County Leitrim. And uh, the following September, I started civil engineering here four years ago. Um, the first three years consisted of my level seven, and this year I went straight on to do my level eight. Um, the first year, you do a lot of core modules, very broad, kind of like the building blocks for the years to come. You've got a wide range of modules, and then towards second and third year, they kind of narrow down to more of the specific modules. We do first year, you do maths, physics, chemistry, a small bit of physics, chemistry. You do a lot of constructing technology, structural design and detailing. Um, environmental subjects and then when you come towards more third year you start to focus in on just the engineering, maths, um, structures, environmental subjects and a lot of different project management subjects. Fourth year then again it's a wide range of subjects again you do the, you don't have maths in the fourth year you finish your maths after your first three years then we have structural scheme design you have um, again environmental engineering subjects you also have uh, two of your biggest modules are advanced civil software where you do about five, six different software modules that you will be using in the workplace and you have an integrated project. That's a module in itself, it's completely continuous assessment, you complete different projects throughout the year. Um, probably the best part of the four years was as part of the first three years in the second semester of the third year you go on a work placement, um, a six week work placement, you can do it in in an office or you can do it out in a construction site. I chose to do it on a construction site. I worked with uh, BAM contractors for six weeks, um, gained great experience with them, um, obtained a summer job from them the following summer, and uh, most of the students did that did the workplace and would hope to get full-time employment from there. Um, the reason I chose uh, GMIT to do civil engineering was, um, one of the main reasons was I dropped honours maths when I was in fourth year. Um, because I kind of steered away from the thought of doing engineering, but then when I was in my leaving search year, I really wanted to do civil engineering, and the fact that you didn't need honours maths to come here um, was a major plus point in choosing it. Um, other reasons such as I was always fond of Galway City, um, I'd heard great things about GMIT, there's a lot of wide range of sports to play here, and I knew there was a good recruitment from the course, civil engineering course, so they were all positives in choosing the course. For our final year project, uh, the main element of it is we got a brief to design a four-storey office block. Um, each group in the class, there's three people in each group, um, so it's a lot of teamwork involved. You have to, the first element of the project is to use your structural scheme de design module to design the, mo to design the office block. Uh, then other modules such as geotechnical engineering feed into uh, designing all the groundworks for it, piled foundations and retaining walls, stuff like that. Um, other modules that would feed into it would be hydrology, design all the drainage for the site where the office is going to be. Um, project management module feeds into the element of it, that planning out the whole project from the day you walk in on the Greenfield site until oh, handing over the keys for whoever's going to take over the office. Um, a lot of other modules that we feed into will be the, we study hydraulics now, so any pumps that would have to go in the site for water flowing around the um, project, uh, hydrology. Another element that feeds into it will be uh, sustainable design, design and sustainable drainage that would be on the project. And altogether, every module that we study this year feeds into, feeds into the integrated project. So you really have to be focusing on all your core modules to feed into the main module at the end of the year.